Pop Pop Fish Goes to the Doctor, written by Wes Adams, illustrated by Isitra Mons, and read by Miss Susie B. Mr. Fish woke up feeling terrible. He didn't want to get out of bed. His friend, Mr. Eight, came to visit. What's the matter? He asked. Are you sick? No, said Mr. Fish. I'm worried about going to the doctor for my checkup today. Checkups help you stay healthy, Mr. Eight said. A visit to the doctor? Nothing to worry about. I know, but I can't help it, said the pout pout fish. Will you come with me? I'd be glad to, said Mr. Eight. On the way there, they saw Miss Shimmer, who said doctor's visits give her the shivers. I don't like how cold the doctor's skin feels on my scales, she explained. But that's how she checks how strong your heartbeat is, said Mr. Fish. It's nothing to fret about. I guess you're right, she said and gave him a warm smile. Miss Clam and Mrs. Squid mentioned their own worries when they heard where their friend was going. I don't like when the doctor weighs me on a scale, said Miss Clam. It feels like I'm riding on a surfboard. But that's how she finds out how much you have grown, said Mr. Fish. You shouldn't let that throw you off balance. I guess you're right, said Mrs. Clam. I don't like the prinkle of the paper on the exam room table, said Mrs. Squid. The doctor uses new paper under each patient to help keep the exam room clean, said Mr. Fish. Good point, she said. Squids are squeamish about sharing germs. In the waiting room at the doctor's office, Mr. Fish's pal got bigger and bigger. I don't understand, said Mr. Eight. You've helped everyone else with their worries. What are you nervous about? Mr. Fish was quiet for a moment. Then he finally said what he was afraid of. I don't like getting shots. He confessed. They made him think of sharp teeth and pointy spines. A shot is just a little pinch and then it's over, said Mr. Eight. That's right, said the doctor as she ushered Mr. Fish into her exam room. And the medicine and shots helps keep you from getting sick. In the exam room, the doctor weighed Mr. Fish and measured him from tip to tail. She used a light to look in his eyes and throat. She took his temperature. She listened to his heartbeat. The doctor was gentle and kind, even when she gave the pow pow fish a shot. That wasn't bad at all, said Mr. Fish. He asked for two bandages. The doctor put them on, and then Mr. Fish was done. Mr. Eight was waiting for his friend. How did it go? He asked. Swimmingly well, said Mr. Fish. A visit to the doctor is nothing to worry about, he assured a nervous-looking little fish whose turn was next. My friend taught me that. Mr. Fish's calm words helped her feel much better. You did a great job today, said the doctor to Mr. Fish. See you next time. See you then, said Mr. Fish, feeling healthy, happy, and strong. All read by Mrs. Susie B., I hope that you enjoyed my storytelling and I will see you next time.